Sir, welcome back to Crash Bandicoot. Cortex Strikes Back. And I finally realized what I gotta do. It's right there. Hit the up button. This entire time I thought I had to do some more. We're heading straight into Snowberries. <laughs> I see that Ripperoo failed to prove much of a challenge yet again. But back to business. There are crystals to be gathered, 20 to be exact. The planets will align shortly, all 13 of them, and this will create a power great enough to rip the Earth apart. Properly utilized, however, the crystals can absorb and contain the energy. Crash, is that you? I've been looking everywhere. I don't have much time to tell you this. You have to be careful. Trusting Cortex seems a little unwise, Crash. Keep the data path open much longer. Crash, you need a phone. Oh, looks like the story is thickening. So apparently the entire time I did defeat Ripper Root correctly. Anyways, let's head straight into Snowbase. Unlock a new path by earning the red gem elsewhere. How do you earn a red gem? I'm assuming by smashing every box. Right? But that's not always possible. I'm honestly quite confused. There we go. Hopefully those crates counted towards my toilet. No! My mask! Oh no, I'm losing my power. Okay, this is just a transporter. Transporting us into a 2D section. Oh, look, that hedgehog looks very angry. I mean, that's a porcupine, not a hedgehog. I get those two mixed up all the time. All right, there's our gem that we need to earn. But how exactly do we earn it? Okay. That was a way too short of a jump right there. Let's try this again. Anyway. I hit the spin button. Spin button does not work. Huh. Let me try the spinning one more time. Spinning does not work. Guess these are just invincible enemies. Okay then. So don't treat these as enemies, just as obstacles. Got it, game. Oh, why do I do this to myself? I killed my own momentum. We're about to get our first game over. We're only in the second world. Second warp room. Quite interesting. Okay, that time I went for it. With no hesitation. I missed a box. Okay. Huh? You bounce on those? What? You wouldn't think you do. What? Why do seals even hurt Crash? They're just seals. These new don't rush or wait obstacles are weird. I'm very used to. Game over. Snow biz. All right then, let's try this again. Okay. I'm making this snow biz my business. I'm not safe. Thought I'd be safe from that distance. Guess not. 
All right, let's try Snowbiz again. Perfect. There we go. Nice. Hopefully there's a sequel to Lights Out in this stage. I mean, in this game. I like that game. I like that stage. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't try, no. You gotta jump for it and go for it. I literally played the first game and I can't even... Get, I can't even play this game. These jumps aren't even that tricky, too. Like, I don't even understand what's going on with me. Alright then. Penguin. You can go now. There we go. Apparently you jump on this. I don't even think it's safe to jump on them. I'm just gonna avoid them. There we go. More crates smashed. Depth perception, depth perception, depth perception. Wait, after a game over, do you only get two lives? No, you get four lives. Great. Why does the game do this? Maybe I can trick the system somehow. Yes, I can. Okay. That one I had enough momentum to get through. But not that. Alright, we hit our checkpoint. This time I'm going to be more patient. Apparently just standing there don't activate it. So that's something I don't have to worry about. Well, I mean, that's one last thing to worry about, is getting crushed. Give me these blocks. Okay. Go. No! My hooga lubuga. Okay. Okay, this is just a bonus path. Thanks for pointing it out. Let's do it. Get that. Okay then. Those are just momentum based jumps. I can do it. Give me this one per group. Why do I not have enough momentum? Maybe I need to do a short hop so I can get enough momentum for an ice. Come on. Are you serious? Let me try this again. No, that's not working either. Wait, instead of doing a short hop. Then I keep doing the long hop. No, the short hop does not work either. Maybe I need to do a body slam. Maybe I need to do slide. Yeah, I do need to do a slide. Interesting. That's an interesting mechanic I did not know about. Good thing we can just try the bonus areas over and over again. No. Come on. Just let me have these boxes. Let me have these crates. Okay. I jumped way too far. Try this again one more time. Unless I somehow make it much further than anticipated. I did. It's not worth trying again. 
Let's just jump past it. Was I supposed to be sliding the entire time? And I didn't even know. These stages are definitely a lot longer. That's probably why they got rid of the... Destroy every box without collecting the gem. I mean, destroy every crate. Without dying motif. That was annoying. There we go. Woo! Let's do a super slide. Nice. 45 of 125 boxes. Crates. Crazy. And it took 10 minutes to beat one level. Interesting. Snow biz. Air crash. A perfect run up to a death platform makes it appear. Huh. A perfect run up to a death platform makes it appear. What is that supposed to mean? Oh, yes! Another one of these stages. Although I'm very sad they got rid of the lily pads. I like the design of these stages the most. Oh, these are much trickier jumps than in the first game. Alright, checkpoint collector. Alright. Let's go ahead and do this. Nope. Okay. Bam. Wait. Wait patiently. Okay, I gotta do this one. Then I have to do an immediate turnaround. Look at this one I got. There we go. I don't trust you. Oh. I guess I couldn't hold a straight line. Okay, so the hippos are just like the crocodiles, apparently. Bonus room. Some of these stages are painless, others are not. Boom. Get this. Boom. Let's do a smash that crate. Boom. What? How could I fail such an easy jump? No. Don't open that. Alright then, let's try this again. However, this time... I'm gonna actually focus on what's going on. Nice. See, this should be easy. Nice. We beat the bonus area. And eight boxes collected. With a hundred two box crates. What? Okay. That was a quite a tricky crate to get. Okay, there we go. No. No. There's a death platform. I'm very curious on what that does. But I guess I don't get to see it. I died. Oh, man. Maybe we can check it out later. And then I died right before it, too. Dun, 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 dun. Boom. Checkpoint collected. Oh 
Huh? Is there an unspoken mechanic? I don't know. Oh no, that's a death. That's the death wish right there. Oh, you can't jump with this. How am I supposed to get those crates? I'm confused. That was all I got to do. Let's just turn right here. No, that's not how you get them. Oh, those bombs are homing in on me. How strange. Well, this is where we the death pop down now. So now we know that we need to not try to not die to a certain point. We're missing about 100 feet. That's a lot of boxes. Crates. Alright, that's better cash completed. We may potentially have enough time for one more level. Barret. Okay then, let's try to Barret. Hello. Oh, whoa. And I can run fast with A. Interesting. I just got a bit. Now, why would I need to run fast? I don't see any evil obstacles that could immediately kill me. Oh, there's the crystal right there. Oh, those orcas don't look good for my health. Let's bear it. Why? Oh. Nice. One extra life. I'm going too fast. And I bear it again. Oh. Game. It's not that funny. Alright, let's go, Mr. Polar Bear. Boom. Nice. Good. Excellent. Just tell. Nice, grab that nice crystal. It's good for my health. Clearly. Mm -hmm. Checkpoint. Let's go. Okay. Jump on that one. That I understand how the orcas work. Oh, I didn't realize there was that half of there. Alright then, I'm so sorry about that. I'll cut it all out. Anyway, so all you really missed was me getting to this checkpoint. No. There we go. Why do I keep doing this? I question if I'm okay. That one. 
one. Got that one. Did switch side. Nope. I'm definitely not okay. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, I don't even understand why that was. Oh, great. Nitro crates. Okay. These nitro crates get very good for me. Oh, what? How am I supposed to make that jump? Okay. There we go. Oh, wow. That's a very tricky jump to make. This one don't work as evil anyway. It shouldn't be. This game is teaching a very bad lesson about how nice workers should be. That's a green crate. I don't trust it. Oh! Huh? I'm confused. Wait, did that just destroy all the nitro crates? Interesting. Anyway, that's it for this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Cortex will be pleased. Oh, what? What's going on here? Huh? I don't know what this means. Yes? I can play as Coco. Nice! It's a variety. Anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.